Hey guys, Fizzy the Frog here, and welcome to a brand new Hytale news video. Today we're going to discuss Hytale's release date being confirmed and many biomes we can expect to see in Hytale. Before we begin, we want to give a huge shout out to our Discord community, which you can join right now. Take a look. Thanks for your patience, and now let's get back into the news. Starting off with Twitter, Simon confirmed yesterday that we will not be seeing a beta release for the game in the next few months. Here's what he had to say. This confirms that we will not be able to play the beta for at least three or more months. This doesn't mean we won't be seeing more gameplay, as seen in the second part of his tweet. He says, We will start blogs and give more info when we are back from the holidays. Keep checking back on Hytale News Daily because we guarantee we will have the blog post covered as soon as possible. Hopefully they don't wait too long as the hype for the game will start to decline. In all honesty, three months seems very reasonable as the trailer was only announced two weeks ago. All right, moving on to the second thing we're going to be covering today, which is all of the biomes we can see and expect to see in the up and coming massive multiplayer game Hytale. If we take a look at the dynamic foliage gameplay video, we can see one biome which seems to be a mushroom forest of some sort. Just look at how the mushrooms glow off the mist. The lighting in this game is truly something else. Side note, on the left side of our screen, we can see an ox sleeping in the night. This biome will most likely include the two trees shown in this clip. The teal leaves mixed with a bit of normal everyday trees. All right, moving forward, our next biome is a savanna. These trees look massive and are also very similar to the acacia trees we see in Minecraft. It seems on the ground level there will be an assortment of brush and wildlife to be found. Moving on, it starts to get chilly as we now enter what seems to be a snowy-like biome. Perhaps a taiga, which is covered in a white blanket of snow. Looking closely, we can see the river, and it's also starting to freeze in. Trees and brush also have snow covered on them. Our last biome presented to us in the video is the nether and or hell world we have seen before many times in the trailer. This place is very dark and dismal with the only light source coming from the lava pools below. In this screenshot, we can spot a castle of some sort in the background that could be perhaps a totally naturally generated structure, kind of like the strongholds we saw in Minecraft. With biomes aside, we have breaking news from Hytale over on Twitter. Here's what they had to say. Modding in hashtag Hytale can get a little explosive. Simon has confirmed that these items will be only assets and will not be able to be obtained in adventure mode. All I have to say is this, these mini games people are going to come up with will be like something we've never seen before. Thank you all for watching, and I hope you have enjoyed. As always, please like, subscribe, comment, and share, and turn on our notification bell so you never miss a future upload. Let us know if we missed anything, and we'll be sure to respond. As we'd love to hear anything more about Hytale's biomes and Twitter news. Signing off, Fezzy the Frog.